All right, we took the battery out of this mower and just wanted to show you this and this mower has been kept inside you can tell by ever just by the way it looks it's been kept inside most of the time so underneath the battery are these little hangers that the battery sets in and uh and they're they always get rusty and what, what it amounts to is it's battery acid eating that up and so I'll tell you what you really need to do that before it goes to rusting all the way through. So it's just, uh, I'll show you what to do. And all you need is some sort of a, a brush. Now I, uh, I've, got, I've got it on a drill just to make it easier for me. But a little hand, uh, one of those hand uh, wire brushes will do just, just as well. And a scraper, some sort of a scraper. And I, got, I like this old scraper. But, let's see. Come down there. You know who that is. Try to get some of this old, old stuff off. These don't have to be perfect because they're going up under a lawnmower battery. So. Now then, Rust-Oleum flat gray primer. Don't really matter what color they are. They don't have to have They don't have to have uh, black paint underneath the battery. But, yeah, we get a good coat of, of paint, a 
Rust Oleum on it. There we go. I'll get the other side after this dries. And you don't have to, uh, as a matter of fact, watch it. Now then. You don't have to worry about the run. It don't matter if it runs. You don't have to worry about the about the color, the paint, or anything. Just put the primer on it. Be done with it. Now you don't have to worry about them things falling out from under your battery. They'll be there another ten years. You know, just every now and then when you change the battery, do that to your battery uh, supports. You know that. I might, even, I might even, I probably will, paint them black before I put them out of there. You know, I, get, I do have some black. So. Anyway, that's just a uh, quick reminder. you got to do those whether you're setting it out in the sun or not. Or out in the rain, out in the weather, if it's in the shed. You really need to check those when you pull your battery and change your battery. All right. I guess that's it for now.